it's about uh, 6.30 a.m. right now. And this is the first day of my treatment, October 15th, 2012. 29 right now, it's my birthday tomorrow. I'll be 30. And this is my birthday present. Get to start treatment for hepatitis C and hopefully clear it from my system forever. Uh, the treatment is uh, Insevac, the new hepatitis C wonder drug, interferon, and ribavirin. Um, I'm hepatitis C genotype 2 and uh, using Insevac to treat genotype 2 is new. It's still in the experimental phase. Um, I am the first patient to be treated by my hepatitis C doctor with Insevac. And uh, should improve my chances of being cleared this time. So right now I am making a protein shake that has more than 20 grams of fat in it because every time I take my Insevac pills, which happen, have to be three times a day, every seven hours on the dot, that's why I'm up at 6.30 specifically to take the first pill. I'll have to be up at 6.30 every day, the entire time I'm taking Insevac. Um, the uh, 20 grams of fat that I have to take is specifically for the medication. It will not work properly unless I have 20 grams of fat with each serving. I'm going to try and use good fats. Because I want to stay as healthy as I can when I'm going through this treatment. last treatment I did was in 2009 and early 2010. It was the, it was the standard treatment of just interferon and ribavirin. Um, I had terrible side effects while I was on that treatment. Lost about 45 pounds, had skin rashes. problems seeing, I had tingling in my arms, I only slept about two hours a night, uh, it was really terrible, terrible depression, depression is actually a side effect of these drugs, um, but it's worth it to take it in the end if they work, but last time I only lasted 19 out of the 24 weeks, I was testing negative while I was on the treatment. But when I did the six month uh, blood test after the treatment, the hepatitis C was back. Um, so this time I'm gonna be on it for 24 weeks and my doses will be increased to the ribavirin and of course the new wonder drug, Insevec, will be included. This of course is my package of the Regular Hep C drugs, interferon and ribavirin, and this is the new drug, Insevac. They have to be kept refrigerated. I'll be going to the hospital to get my shot of interferon today.
I've actually seen a nutritionist this time to help me get through this uh, hepatitis C treatment. Um, so I'll be on a special diet. Because, of course, one of the terrible side effects of the new drug, Incidec, is you actually can get hemorrhoids from the hepatitis C treatment. So my diet's going to play a big factor in avoiding some of these side effects. And, of course, I'm going to be continuing to take my regular vitamins to boost my immune system while I'm on these drugs to help avoid as many side effects as possible. I lost uh, my WWE contract because of hepatitis C. And uh, yeah, my liver enzyme values are elevated, my spleen is enlarged. Um, those, those effects can be reversed if I get cured. I've always been just a very intense person in the gym and while I'm on this treatment I'm not allowed to lift heavy weights or strain for six months. So that's going to be absolute torture for me and that's a side effect that uh, people that aren't gym rats like myself don't really have to worry about, but uh, it's going to be quite torturous for me. There's a lot of uh, positive things about treatment this time, why I think it will work when it didn't work last time. One of them is I'm prepared. I know what to expect. I'm not going to pretend I'm Superman. Last time I still continued my MMA training, weightlifting. So I'm going to check what I weigh before I start my treatment. One of the side effects of the Hep C treatment is you have less blood cells in your body and less bone marrow. So it causes muscle wasting. So I'm 281.8, lean, muscular, 281.8 right now. So hopefully I'll get lucky and with this strict diet I'll keep, I won't lose too much weight. So again, this is the new Incivac pills. This is only part of my treatment. I have to take these two exactly every seven hours. Can't miss a dose. And for them to work, they have to be taken with interferon and ribavirin. These pills actually attack the virus directly. Well, the interferon and ribavirin boost your immune system. So adding these to the regimen should help my chances. There's been a great percentage of the success rate for hepatitis C type 1 patients, but again, I'm type 2, and this is very new. It hasn't been tested much on hep, hep C type 2 patients. These are very expensive drugs. And since they're new and experimental for my type, they're not covered by the government. I'm very fortunate that I was able to get these drugs. And uh, here we go.
so the treatment has begun. I'm excited but very nervous and a lot of people ask me uh, if I have any fears and yes I do. Um, the treatment last time was the most horrible thing I ever went through in my life and uh, I guess my biggest fear is what's going to happen to me this time but the important thing is and the thing that I'm very happy about is if this works I'll be cured by the time I'm 31 and uh, I'll still have about 10 years of good athletic ability in me maybe 50 or more if I take care of myself so it's definitely worth the risk And those are my uh, ribavirin pills. They're taken along with the interferon and the uh, Incivec. I'll be taking my interferon shot at the hospital around 4.30 today.